What is up, everybody? My name is Hudson. Welcome back to Repentance. Only a few more items to touch, you guys. Super bandage, Little Chad, Scissors, Moving Box, Death Certificate, Urn of Souls, Little Portal, Isaac's Tomb, Esau Jr. Let's jump back in as one of my favorite characters, The Lost. Let's see if we can't get some of these. I think we got all Devil Deal items. Urn of Souls, I know, is Angel. Isaac's Tomb is Secret Room. So maybe we do an Angel run on this one. God's Flesh. It's just not going to be good enough for me as The Lost, Touching Enemies. Does not make sense. Tears can shrink enemies. Shrunken enemies can be crushed by killing or walking over them. Um, taking damage? No. Off to a rousing start here. Isaac's Fork. No effect to the lost. One of my favorite characters. Humbling Grundle. 15 cents on the first floor is a tall ask, but we'll see what happens. I probably need a couple bombs here and a secret room that's got some cash in it. And another reroll. Black Bean. Isaac farts multiple times when damaged. I think we need the birthright here. Birthright for a lost removes all when damaged or when taking damage items. Oh, well, it's almost a bomb. You almost did the thing. Let's see if I can get top secret room over here. No. You're gonna be difficult, eh? Black Bean, goodbye. It was worth the wait, y'all. Sci Fly, actually off to a good start now. Now let's get some unlocks. Pog, we're pogging. I'm now pogging. Bombs. One bomb. That looks like secret room right there. Then a weird spot. Oh, you know what? Explosive enemy. Um, We gotta be creative here if we wanna get everything in one go. So I'm gonna move this over to where the, the location is where I want the bomb to blow up the secret room door entrance. Top secret room must be off the bottom as well. So here's maybe what we're gonna do. We'll maybe get this guy to, to pop closer to the, the door here. And then I can walk in. One of the bombs is in the right spot. The other one is not exact. Oh, I, I really missed out on that one. Got one secret room here. I'm gonna go into here. Push this down like that. Top secret room. You know it. You know it. We're doing it. What do we have? We have Soul of Bethany. I'm gonna use that immediately. Reverse death card. Book of the Dead. Strength and Fool. Let's maybe take the strength into the boss. Pop it. This room has the cash. But we really needed like a nickel or dime there. Reroll ready in case it's a health upgrade. This should be an easy fight. We'll take Book of the Dead with us. Book of the Dead would have been really good in here. I didn't know it was gonna be Duke. Bone fragment for every death. Speed and range. Um, it's not a health upgrade, so I think I'll just take it. Not DPS, but we have Sci-Fly. The game says it's a 20% chance for the Eternal D6. 25% chance to delete items when realistically we know deep down, down in here, it's not. It's a 75% chance to delete the item. But Hots, didn't it give you like three good rerolls? Shut up, Tim. No one cares. No one cares about what you have to say right now. I might blow up my machine. We're the lost, you know? You know. Can I grundle and leave and come back and have them be duplicated? No. That's not how it works. Well, anyways, I'm happy to be grundling. We don't want to go all path because to see Chad, I think you got to get it uh, to caves. Another explosive enemy. I won't be able to put him where I want him. But that's probably telling me there's a secret room off of this room somewhere. Spectral shot. Thank you, Lost. Treasure room's got large zit. I like large zit. I could sit here and reroll all day long to try to get the things that we want, but I'll probably end up just erasing items. The odds of actually pulling off an item that we need is just slim, 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 slim. So let's maybe instead have a good Lost run. If we get the unlocks, great. If we don't, well, we'll just have to play more. Oh no. Converter? No, oh, okay. I do kind of want the bombs and keys though. Thank you. Large zit, independent of your fire rate, will pop out a little slow shot that spreads some creep on the ground. And I think slow shot is, is just good. This could be good. Um, When taking damage. Nice. Blood puppy. No. No. I'm sorry. Six room. Also. No. Oh, nice. I was trying to lure him over to find a secret room and he just blew up my face. I think curse room reroll is pretty high value, so let's go back. Switch it up to... Ooh, wow, okay, Curse of the Tower. Sweet, dude. I thought once it was on a pedestal, a non-shop purchase devil pedestal, that it removed it from the item pool. Is it? Is it back to when you touch it now? I don't know. I feel like this game is like literally making me go crazy. At one point in time, I knew everything and then they changed everything and now I don't know everything. So I relearned everything, but then they changed everything again. Oh, okay, Top Secret Room's off of this. Oh, well, I totally fucked that up. Translation prize. Fire rate. Nice. My favorite. Something's wrong. That's not. That's not my favorite. Top secret room is exactly where I thought it was. 
and some batteries for extra reroll so that we can eat items so I can get more curse of the tower going on back to get curse of the tower Shazam Ooh. skipping the devil remember skipping the devil we want to go angel for the urn of souls it is the hunt tough fight no don't you get that close to me the physics of these guys bouncing around is just maddening oh wow he almost hit me in the back swing there TNT barrel bombs do a lot of damage to haunt if he does that spread like that, I don't know if I can actually trust my Psy Fly to, to deflect all those shots. We're good. We're good. Uh, DPS upgrade. I'm just going to go ahead and take it. Nothing else to do besides to move on. Angel, here we come. Pearl necklace. I don't need the range. Tech 2. You know, I do take Tech 2. Even though it's a 0.67 fire rate multiplier, it hurts. But it's worth it, I think. Constant laser of damage. The laser deals 2x Isaac's damage per second. We're looking for something like homing now to really take this to the next level. There's a room D10. I like it since it's update where it devolves enemies instead of just randomly switching them to something potentially harder, but not taking it. Mr. Mega, five bombs and 1.85 bomb times the bomb damage. That's so specific. I could probably wait on it. Switch it to Sir Dumpertons. Yes. Wow. Okay. We got a combo going on. Very defensive combo. Psy fly to block projectiles. Sir Dumperton to block any enemy that damages me for any reason, including contact damage. One heckin' lost run, for sure. Shop has got some stuff. Box of friends, oh man. You mentioned going into a fight with two Sir Dumpertons and two Psy Flies. I don't really want it though. Mega Fatty, not Chad. There's no way we don't have the boss Chad unlocked, right? It's like kill mom's heart 10 times or something to get Chad unlocked. How have we not seen Chad once during our entire third save file. That's insane to me. We got him. We got some cash. I don't really need the cash. I love getting perfection here, though, is lost. Nothing luck-based yet, but you just wait. Range and contact damage. Some of our stuff is, like, perfect for the lost, and some of it is just so ironic. Why you do this? Let's do a reroll in the shop, maybe, instead. Reverse temperance card, five random pills to be taken. Let's do that after this room. Give me some good stuff. Paralysis, that's exactly why I did not take it immediately. Cubes, retro, walk on sunshine, health up. It's like the best. I never did find the secret room. The secret rooms have been in increasingly ridiculous places. And I had a seed that spawned no secret room at all. I'm very confused what's going on with secret room generation. It's like Ed was like, yeah, we want the regular secret room to be touching three other rooms. And then people are like, oh, we figured that out. And he's like, you figured that out? H how about this? I mean, that's exactly what happened to this shop, right? Reroll. Yep. Tears. I like that. Eternal heart. Yep. All in all, looking up to be a solid run. Thanks to my rerolls. Imagine if we had a lost run that did not start with Eternal D6 right now. <laughs> Shop, not very impressive. Jar, how about moving box? Shazam. Notched axe, don't even hate it. Pretty good for finding secret rooms and breaking rocks and like crawl spaces and whatnot. Tinted rocks for free. But the Eternal D6 has just been so nice to me. D6 is both the best and worst part about a run. It's the best because it's been giving us tons of good stuff. It's the worst because I gotta keep backtracking. Oh my gosh, is that the board? Vessel Etruscan ceramic. I don't even care it says taking damage. I must have it. It must be mine. Secret room. Can I get an item in here at some point in time? That's not an item. Boss trap was squeezy. More tears? You know what? Let's do it. Could have waited to get more charge, but 342. We got to be somewhat capped here on fire rate soon with our 0.67 damage or uh, fire rate multiplier, rather. Treasure room and shop and cathedral. Um, I technically don't have anything luck based, so maybe. Gosh darn that that reskin but i don't know if we're gonna go to the chest what's better than one more treasure room and one more shop potentially getting like seventeen thousand more chests on the chest yeah plus the luck will help us out with items that do depend on it can i get a gulp please that's a card against humanity it's good let's use it in this l room it's gonna be a delight to break the poops with our laser Look at that. Gotta pay attention for the trinket, though. As soon as possible. Trinket. 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 Still no? Are you kidding me? The money's nice, though. Dang. Treasure room, little Steven. Cool. Oh my gosh, it's Chad. It's happening! Eat that bomb. That'd be funny if I just re-rolled Chad. Maybe that's what happened. Maybe I've been re-rolling little Chad or something. Black running him. I don't know. Like I said, I, I find it hard to believe I haven't seen a uh, little Chad yet. 
Uh, okay, well that settles it. We actually have not fought Chad once. Andrew, though, is looking pretty good. There's my little Chad. I'm gonna remove that. Six more items that we can get. Two more after that that we have to finish Tainted Jacob for. Earn a souls? No. Purgatory. Let's bomb the angel, fight him, and then reroll the key piece even. Okay, I could really use a damage upgrade. Realizing now I'm at base damage. So like if you slip the sacred heart into the mix, I wouldn't complain too hard. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Negative one, negative two, negative three. Revelations, yes, that is going to be holy brim. And then immaculate conception, picking up 15 hearts spawns a permanent angelic familiar. I don't know if that'll work, but we can still technically pick up soul hearts and, and black hearts as the lost. Not the best, but we'll see. There's now a chance also that we get devil rooms. Oh, soul heart. There's one, there's two. We'll have to try to uh, donate money to our donation machine. Did we blow up the donation machine? I think we killed it. Never mind then. Because donating 10 cents to your donation machine also increases angel chance. Shop at 99 cents gives me greed, of course. Why wouldn't it? Steam sale though. Second to last shop. Do I buy the steam sale or do I try to reroll it to get a moving box? Just thinking I don't really need the steam sale for the next floor. Like maybe if there is a reroll machine, but 99 cents, you guys. Whatever it is, I can afford it. Items gone, rip in pieces. Yo, listen, we do have a lack of bombs, maybe. We want to get a secret room item, so I'll take Yolo so we can find all of our secret rooms. Sister Viss, sometimes a tricky boss. And they do their teleport to either side of you or, or massive laser beam. Yeah, that one. Devil deal. Fire rate upgrade, are we capped yet? 0.24 fire rate, we gotta be capped at 367. And then our devil deal has uh, a mom's knife in it, which is like basically a GG. Oh, what I forego going angel rooms just so that we can have a good finish to this run. Cause you guys, 3.5 damage <laughs> is not. Not cutting it. I think I gotta take the knife. Depth two, maybe, 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 maybe we will get chaos in the shop or something. So, uh, crawl space? Sure is. With that guy? What about that guy? It was greed mode, maybe. How about glaucoma? Nah. How about nothing? Oh boy. First room's gonna teleport. Um, yeah, you know what? Oddly enough, I do kind of like the idea of getting Dark Bum here and having him turn my red hearts into black hearts and then those black hearts counting towards my Immaculate Conception. Although I feel like there could be something really stupid behind the scenes. I don't know if you guys know this, but the Alabaster box can be charged with either soul hearts or black hearts, but if you are the lost specifically, picking up black hearts does not gain charges. Seems like a bug to me. That seems like something really, really weird. Upon picking up 15 heart pickups, says Immaculate Conception, the lost can pick up soul hearts and black hearts despite having no health, thus can activate Immaculate Conception. Okay, it says right there. Feed me, Dark Bomb. That's that's not it. You get hearts from this guy. Skittle, all right. Latch key for more luck. Damage, please. I cannot believe how much we've dodged damage upgrades in this game. Switch it up to a damage upgrade. Well, the soul heart could work towards my Immaculate Conception, no. Cool. Another black heart drop, nice. Secret room, super greed. Can I get an item? Yes, I can. Plan here is to try to re-roll that into Isaac's tomb. Go. Vanishing twin, two boss drops. Well, that's kind of fun. <laughs> Sometimes I get these really weird items that like, I just want to take. Look, I know it's going to take more runs then. Are you complaining about getting more runs? I like to have fun. First and foremost, that's the most important thing. Watch, I'm going to get absolutely slaughtered now because I have to fight two bosses. <laughs> Reroll Skatol into Zodiac. Um, shop's got more curse rooms. Sure. Well, maybe go for moving box. <laughs> First judgment. Spawns a restock machine. Hmm, I like that. At the moment, probably gonna save that for chest, but I would prioritize that over a uh, item in the secret room. I'd prioritize the secret room rather more to get them the uh, Isaac's tomb. Ooh, little dry baby. That's very defensive for loss. That's good. Okay, here we go. More black hearts. Don't forget that any heart spawned in this room will turn into a red heart, so you gotta leave before you wanna get him to drop the black hearts. Still no angelic familiar yet. Fills a luck down. I'm down to nine luck with a perfection. That's sad. Mom fight. We're gonna get some slow knife taps here. I don't wanna charge it too much and throw it too long. 
Got her. Easy stuff. Definitely going chest here. Utero one. 3.5 damage. That's insane. That's that's crazy talk. That is wild to me. Bopped curse. No. Red key. Also no. I'm gonna say no. Uh, did we get a, a familiar there? I thought I saw something. Yes, we did. I see a guardian angel around me. Nice. Angelic familiar is very defensive. Very good for me as the lost. Luck upgrade. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Top secret room with a bunch of red chests. Teleport to the devil would be great. I'd rather actually get an item to be able to reroll it into secret pool for my Isaac's tomb. Item, no item, no item, no item. Range up, no item, and no item. But we did get some balls. This is a dangerous room. I hate these guys. I totally forgot that we had the holy brim since I'm not charging my knife up to that level anymore. Conquest fight. I think the pony, oh, double conquest, I forgot. I forgot. Protect me, Sir Dumperton. This is wild. This is a wild fight right now. Nice, little Jesus juice. Is that a damage upgrade? No. Devil Deal's got some balls and some poop. You know what? Let's just take the Hungry Soul, reroll the pony, and there's another damage upgrade. Holy crap. My powers have doubled since you've last seen me. Small rock and a bobbed rotten head. Um, Here I am saying like I really, really, really need damage upgrades, so I probably should just take that. I, I could add two pedestals, but Maggie's bow, no effect for the lost. Oh, is that a, just a free, free what's it call it? Should be able to just grab that and have that be, I guess, not that beneficial for the knife. We don't really care what our fire rate is, but whatever. Kind of cool that it was free. I don't think I've ever seen that room before. Cliffs fight. Not too bad. Mom's knife. No devil angel, though, unfortunately. Up we go. Cathedral is a very tough floor. Not super excited about it. Could be a mini mush, magic mush. I don't want of these, you know, or nothing. 48 hour energy, that's a cool one. Balls, probably doesn't count towards my immaculate conception. Let's get this gotta pay out, I guess. You tell me there's a crawl space underneath that pot? Show it to me. And that's rotten meat. Health ups, just the best. Ooh, <laughs> tonsil trinket. Reroll that, okay. Super lost, super 48 hour energy. We've got charges in the floor, just give me an item. Ooh, Cricket's head. Lots of damage now. Oh, here we go. Okay, secret room with a beggar in it that we can get an item out of. Cricket Penny. And you know, maybe, 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 if I take this chariot card over here, we can maybe get the blood donation machine to pay out with a an IV bag? No, just saying two pedestals would have been nice. I suppose the soul of Jacob and Esau could do the same. Soul of Jacob. Drop the super drowsy pill, interesting. Oh, the health up. I suppose I could have used that as Esau. My bad. Start off with our judgment. Reroll machine. See if we can't get that Isaac's tomb. No. Nope. Still no. Did we get a crawl space in this floor? We totally did. Forget me now. Oh. Oh. I gotta say yes. I gotta say yes in the glitched crown because that's like gonna be kind of easy to get way more items and potentially the ones that we really want. Super drowsy pill on this boss since Isaac can be tricky. It's neutered him. And now with all of our luck and glitched crown, let's cross our fingers and hope that we get a scissors. I'm hoping for a scissors here. I think we could potentially get super bandage scissors and little portal right now. Ready, steady, goey. No in there. Isaac's heart, yeah. No, mm, still no. Nothing I absolutely need. Reroll it, two of them are gone. All right, come on, give me more. This is a tough room here. Hungry soul, doing a great job. Nice, hungry soul, really nice. <laughs> Holy smokes. Secret room is also right here. The chest that is a secret room chest. I A would love to have technology. I would take that probably hands down. I mean, infamy also not bad. Damage reduction for uh, the loss is good, but I got to reroll this. Just ho hopefully get a pedestal to get rock bottom. No, I mean, oh gosh, we just rerolled out of almond milk, son of a gun. I, I want to take pog bottom, you guys. I really, really, really do, but it's really late in the game and we're going for unlocks and I got to be true to that. It's a, it's a freaking five options pedestal in my secret room. It's the reason I took glitched crown in the first place. We gotta try. Remember, only a 25% chance to erase it. Right, right, 
Rerolling secret room. Now we got still no, still no tomb. TM trainer, epic fetus missing. No, just just top quality stuff. Really, nothing but the best. Hey, look, a lot of chads. Another pedestal here with little portal. Hello. So you can see in the upper left, little portal is flashing. That means that we need to take it. What I could do is do the pause buffer, or whatever, blah 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 thing. But nah, I'm not a cheater. We got it. We got him, y'all. We're doing really, really well. And for a secret room reroll, five, four, three, two, one, bro. Balls. Still, no, I cannot believe how many items that we're seeing in here to not get in Isaac's tomb. We have it unlocked, right? I swear we have it unlocked. Another reroll. Yeah, it, it was about time that they were going to be erased. I, I felt that one. I don't even think there were any other items in the secret room pool. Like we had to get it next or delete the item. And of course we were going to delete the item. How about some skiz? Oh, there's soy milk again soy milk mom's knife is so 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 bad two pedestals in here tech five so good parasitoids so good seeing every single bomb upgrade under the sun as well two pedestal reroll go we got nothing we need there maybe in eden's blessing i think for my next run would be smart still no skiz i think parasite might actually work Works with the laser for sure. And it does work with the knife. This is confirmed. Do you have a skizzers, please? Inner eye. That's fun. Lost fly. He's good. Capricorn. Schwer. Hmm. Pyro and host hat in one room. I'll take the pyro. You know what? I'm gonna rando on this one. What do you got? Hemoptysis. I can sneeze. Too many pedestals, not enough rerolls. I'm gonna rando some of these just to keep things exciting. Go. Tracky beams. Once again, fire rate does not really matter right now. I'm gonna get in this one. Bam. Sticky bombs. How about you? Oh! <laughs> what are the odds? Soy milk with a knife is just absolute ripperoni. Fire rate doesn't matter for I don't think the laser or the knife. Shard of glass, sure. Yeah, look at look at the damage now. Look at the damage difference. Just tapping the knife too sends it full full blast. How could you? Magic mushroom though. We already have cricket's head, so we won't be able to get that damage multiplier again. It's all for nothing. Just go pick whatever random. Mom's wig, great. This is gonna be a tough final battle, you guys. Guys, we might not pull through. What do you got here? Is that a super bandage? No freaking way. We got it. We got the super bandage, you guys. Look at our list. We're doing such a good job. Scissors, moving box, urn of souls, Isaac's tomb. Happy that we pulled that out before losing with a soy milk knife. Ooh, I actually would take the sinus infection. Survival mode now. Last run before our boss. And I guess we just try to load boogers up with the lasers or something. I don't know. Yeah, maybe charge holy brim. Blue baby fight. Here it is. We're there. All my defensive items protect me. Spawns a lot of extra flies and stuff, so hopefully Hungry Soul can spawn some dudes to help me out. Oh, I got hit there on my switch over. I got, I got nailed right in the face. No, no, no. Don't trap me in the corner, please. Oh yeah, that's way too close, buddy. That's way too close. Personal space, bro. We got him. We got him. We did it. No, I'm not doing delirium. I'm, I, I'm, I can't. I won't. I'm calling it there, you guys. We did such a good job on those unlocks. That is an amazing amount of, of items that we got today. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below on these just standard lost runs. We'll have to decide once we defeat Isaac, once we get infinity percent, if we want to still do maybe custom challenge runs, mod showcases, and potentially standard runs like this. Like we could go back, do some throwback lost runs if you guys are enjoying it. Like I said, let me know. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you and I will see you in the next one.